Good day, fellas. I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill. And today we are going to play with a Panzer 7 Tier 10 German Super Heavy Tank. Well, is it Super Heavy Tank? Well, the worst part of all of this vehicle is that people can penetrate you into the frontal mantlet around this area, especially if you are tiny touching, uh, tiny touch, um, turning the gun, you are exposing your weak spots. And even not, not. You do not even need to turn the gun in order to do so. So yeah, that is that is the worst part of this tank. Other than that, it would be completely normal vehicle and it would be all right. Um, anyways, I truly dig the calm of this tank. For me, this tank reminds me um, Christmas uh, and this tank reminds me loot boxes, fellas. And you know what? I'm not alone who has the same feeling and same situation. I believe there is... Ooh, I believe there is plenty of people who are looking into all of this... Um, Art on this vehicle and they are thinking oh yeah loot boxes that sounds like a plan you know this is how it looks like at least to me anyways what do we want to do we want to get involved like this I think this is the correct way to do the things uh, and hopefully we are not going to get slaughtered meanwhile uh, what do we have the most dangerous tank in this situation is probably chieftain who is lurking around this area do I actually want to cross? Do I actually want to cross? Maybe, maybe I should. You know what? Maybe I should, fellas. It depends how much damage we are going to take meanwhile, but we are going to go for it. Okay, phase one took one. Oh, yop, I am not crossing. I am not even considering about crossing. Oh, yop, papa. Fellas, uh, plan changed. I do not want to cross. <laughs> well, that was that was uh, an interesting one, if you would ask me. I was considering about going full in, you know. I was considering about going brrrr and making a hardcore pressure here, but no. I mean, luckily we had a phase one who said, Skill, well, listen. If you want to cross, this is what is waiting for you around the corner. And luckily this guy showcased how good of the experience we would have. Beautiful shot to the chieftain, very, very nice. So all we need to do in this situation is lurk around the corner over there, that's it. This is our gameplay. We are just lurking here and waiting until enemies will get involved and until enemies will come and slap us. Yeah, I know, no, definitely not the best uh, uh, game plan and not the best situation, but looks like uh, this team um, knows what they are doing. I'm speaking about the enemies. This is a very, very, very solid and aggressive gameplay from the enemy team. I mean, there is a pixel, but us hitting that pixel, uh, it is very, very, very low chance. And you know what? I have a feeling the gangbang isn't coming. I would love to say we would have uh, plenty of the other options how we could get involved here or how we could save the game, but unfortunately, it's not the case, guys. Okay, understood. Let's try to go like this. Beautiful. We are escaping here and we are trying to fight for our life in this situation. But this is very, very, very complicated and it is very, very sad in the same time. Can I do something about it? No, not really. Whenever you have a situation like this and whenever the lemming train is coming uh, over the board, you know, whenever... You are just getting slaughtered like this. All you can do, you can say thank you very much, game. I appreciate you and have a lovely day. That's all you can say. And once again, I'm not even feeling bad about this game. I do not feel like we have done something extremely bad or something. But this is a uh, world of tanks nowadays, you know. Um, it's just how this game works, fellas. Um, and we should be happy with our 2.4 thousand damage and 900 assisting damage. It happens for the best of us. Accept it. And let's hope that the game will give us something better for our next game. You cannot do anything about this. It's it's the same situation like uh, tsunami is coming for you and you are trying to uh, stop it with your body, you know? It's not going to happen. So let's see the score. Actually, this is World of Tanks at the finest. I want to see Arta Drown. Watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this. No! <laughs> I, 
I was, I was about to, I was about to, I was about to sing his a submarine song, fellas. Well, hashtag never lucky. Listen, fellas, there is no need to be upset about the games like this. I know it happens for most of us. I know there is nothing what we can change about this. So, you know, just look at this uh, from a bit different side. If you are enjoying the game, you know, if you are having a great time, just look at this from the different side. Just smile a bit and say, well, well, better luck next time, you know, hopefully next time the game will will be a bit better and that's all we have. So yeah, 2.4 thousand damage, 900 assisting damage, oh my bananas, we are first by experience, we are second by the damage and we broke even or even made a bit of the credits, that's fine. No complaints, no regrets, let's keep it up. Okay, this looks significantly better, Mountain Pass Standard Battle. Uh, this looks like the game where we can actually slap the enemies left, right and center. I am a big fan of playing this side, right? So that's what we are going to do. We are going to try to put a, a humongous pressure towards the enemies and hopefully we are not going to meet uh, 60 TP um, or CC1 MK2. Uh, because those are probably the worst tanks for us to meet in the position where we are going to play. Pretty much we are trying to avoid to meet someone playing, someone with a lot of armor playing in this position, right? That's all we care about. And we are going to be aggressive here. Or are we? Or are we going to be aggressive here? This is the question. Do we want to go Vroom? Three... Two, one, now. I'm just going for a blind shot, unfortunately I missed that one, but it's okay. Listen, looking into our lemming train, right, everyone is going on the ice road, like, there is no tomorrow, everyone is... So maybe this is not the wisest choice for us to get involved to the maximum and to simply make pressure like this, right? We do not know where the enemy team is yet, so we need to be smart. We definitely need to be smart, fellas. I'm waiting until more of the enemy forces would get spotted, and whenever they will, then we are going to make a decision. Do we want to get involved here or not? Because, believe me, this lemming train is going to get spotted, and whenever this lemming train will get spotted, then we will figure out maybe enemies wants to go in. Okay, look at this. Enemies have a safe defense parameter here as well. Okay, very, very nice. This is what I want to see and this is what I like to see. So, first things first. What do we want to do? We want to... Oppa, 60 TP, obviously fire, unfortunate. Not much what we can change about that. Let's try to escape from here. Okay, listen, my man, I love you with all my heart, shoe. We are going to sit the hold down here then. It's unfortunate. Okay, CC is playing here as well. Not a big deal. We are fine. At least I don't really think I can complain about that. I'm trying to hit the cupola of Baza, but unfortunately I'm failing. It's okay. We can hold this side, fellas. Um, looking into amount of the guns, we can definitely see that enemies have more guns over there compared to us. But I do not really think that is changing something. Next shell is going to be a PCR, by the way, so we can start beating the living crap out of this uh, uh, 60 TP, right? Now, cupola shot. Let's aim it well, and here you go. Cupola shot worked just fine. Very nice. Mmm... What to do now? What to do now? Enemy team is losing. That is a good stuff for us. We like to see... Uh, you will like to see that for sure. But what we can do here? What we can do here? This is the question. If I will keep making a hardcore pressure, this is going to be very, very hard, fellas. This is going to be super hard for us. Beautiful shot to the 60 TP. Very, very nice. That's what we need, fellas. That's what we need. Patiently waiting around the corner and just slapping enemies whenever they are messing up and whenever they are doing something silly. This is our mission in this situation. You know, 
This is not the main uh, um, attack from our side. I do not need to be that aggressive. I can chill out. I can just simply wait until enemies will mess up, right? There is no need for us to get super involved and after that regret our life choices. It is completely unnecessary. And in the same time, sure thing, I would have feel a bit better if we could obviously cross here and take this position over there. But unfortunately, it wasn't the case, you know, that's the thing. And this XTTP is super patient. You know what? I'm not that patient. Let's go. Let's show the dominance. How about that? Let's show the dominance, fellas. Okay, he just fired it. Now we are going in. This is the moment whenever we are going to say hello for this mother trucker, fellas. You know he's alone. I know he's alone. All we need to do, we need to keep it up. He's looking into our cupola or into the our um, big spot, I suppose to say. But it changes absolutely nothing. All we are doing here is we are being very, very, very aggressive. That's all we are doing. Beautiful shot over there. Very nice. And now this is a pure bullying of this XTTP. Uh, how does he feel like? He feels great. He feels great, fellas. He's enjoying his um, gaming experience to the maximum. And he is saying, mm -hmm. I'm glad I played with a 60 TP. And now the best part of all of this. This CC is going to go on the reload very, very soon. And you know what that means? That means he is going to get slapped by us. Plus, on top of that, we have some forces sitting here. Um, so we should be all right. At least that's what I guess. Meanwhile, he's trying to make pressure. Oh, what a beautiful pressure, you beautiful, magnificent mother trucker. Very nice. This is what we need for a full happiness. Now, we are going to push him to the wall. We are going to make him enjoy his life choices. And we are going to make a better angle for ourselves. We are just simply using our... Uh, um, we are just simply using our power. Right? That's it. And now we are talking. So, how is your day? Are you enjoying yourself? Are you entertained? Are you having a great time? You do. You do have a great time. Beautiful. Have a lovely day, my man. Have a lovely day. Uh, that's it. I mean, looking into the games like this, you cannot say that this vehicle is the worst tank in the world of tanks and it is unplayable. No, it's not. It is actually, it actually looks like completely fine tank, right? Well, minus that fire because we got lit on fire from the very first shot. So we started evaluating our life choices. But other than that, that is okay. Let's teleport to the scoreboard. By the way, you know what was the funnest part of all of this? Two tanks which I did not want to meet, I met. Other than that, I did not give a um, caco about absolutely anything. But I met those two tanks what I was af for who was I was afraid the most, you know? Uh, my brain is farting a bit. Anyways, what I want to say, I want to say I met the tanks which I really did not want to meet. Um, that's about it. Anyways, 4.1 thousand damage, uh, 3... Kills, rigged brother in arms, steel wall, I am okay with that. We are fifth by experience, we are first by the damage. That worked just fine, hip hip hooray. And uh, we got quite a bit of profits as well. That is very, very beautiful and that is very, very nice. You beautiful panzer. Let's go for uh, round number three and let's try to make it work. Okay, round number three, highway it is. So, we have a lot of, a lot of super heavies in this game, right? There is, there is Super Conquerors, there is Panzer, there is E100, AMAX, maybe Minotauro who will be aggressive, Bobject who will be aggressive, I mean, we got this. Uh, we are definitely having the fight in the city, so all we need to do, we need to make it work. How hard it can be, fellas, huh? How hard it can be? Okay, for a very first shot, we are aiming where the Panzer is going or where EBR is going. You know what? Let's go for a blind shot just like so. You never know when you are going to hit the shots like this. You never know. So why not to try? And I think we have enough forces to challenge the enemies here as well. I think we should be alright. 
So our plan is straightforward. All we want to do, we want to take this safe position here so we can slap the guys who are trying to peek here or alternatively who will try to cross like this. Obviously, I'm not entirely sure am I going to arrive into that position. Uh, first, maybe someone else will take it as an example 260. There is a big chance he will join that position and if it would be the case, it would be a bit sad, but we'll see. And honestly speaking, a lot of a lot of enemy forces are playing in this side. So what that means, that means they might try to side scrap over there. We'll see. Or maybe they are just taking the longer road in the same time, right? Just to be safe. You never know. And what do we have? We have Almighty Super Conqueror. The thing is, what the Super Conqueror won't expect. I don't really think the Super Conqueror will expect the guy going straight like this and slapping him for 600 in the face. Beautiful, very, very nice. And now we are side scrapping here around the corner. That's all we need to do for a full happiness. And let's try to make this beautiful tank work. E100 fire maybe? Not fire, but a bit of the engine critical damage probably. I think we slapped his engine. This is the main reason what happened here. But this is the main thing what happened. Lit him on fire. Come on. Ooh, 686. Ay, 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 ay. Mr. E100. I have a feeling he's regretting his life choices a bit and he is thinking, ay, yeah, 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 I wish to play a bit uh, safer here. But you know, mistakes were made, not much what he can change about this. And now we are going to get involved. I know that enemies have quite a lot of the snipers in the back, but you know what, I do not care. I am going in because I am almighty panzer, how about that? I am almighty panzer and I could not care less about that. I will take one more from this guy, it doesn't really change anything, we are hitting him in the face, good, 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 and next step for us will be to get involved against the guy sitting here. I believe I do not really need to highlight how this game is looking like and that uh, our team is actually beating the living crap out of the enemies. But it doesn't change the fact that we can be very, very successful here. Beautiful shot to the Super Conqueror, very, very nice. And now we are gaming. What I want to do, I want to cross like so, we are okay. No complaints, no regrets. The best part of all of this is that this Super Conqueror is not paying attention, so we slapped him once again, beautiful. And now Minotauro has a lot of, a lot of, a lot of troubles, fellas. Minotauro is thinking, oh my bananas, what I supposed to do now? Boom, into the track, beautiful shot, very, very nice, and all we need to do, we need to keep making pressure here. There is no need for us to stop, we, we established that enemy team is just uh, losing the game, right? Uh, they cannot do absolutely anything in this situation, and we are going for a rest of the damage like there is no tomorrow. Can we get a good shot? Yes, we can. Well... If you could call 88 damage a good shot. And as you can see, fellas, you can lead the charge with this tank. You can actually get involved and you can make a hardcore pressure like there is no tomorrow. You can be involved here. Is it, is it the best tank in the world of tanks? Well, definitely no, it isn't. Looking into amount of the damage which we blocked in this game, we pretty much haven't blocked any anything. Although if you would pay attention at this pretty much, uh, all the shots we uh, been penetrated by was by the gold. But this is world of tanks in 2023. There is absolutely nothing what we can do about this apart obviously crying ourselves to sleep. That's all we can do. So yeah, unfortunate. Unfortunate. Am I happy with this performance? Sure thing. I pushed the W key and we got a, a very, very nice um, performance, you know? I do not really think I can complain about this. And by the way, both of the light tanks can actually try to cap our base. There is a humongous possibility that we, they will go into the cap and they will cap us out. That would be very, very sad. Oh yes, our guys need to get into the cap. Vaza, you are about to cost the game for us. Vaza was near the cap. Ay, 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 ay. Fellas, in this situation, all I can do, I can hope for the best to hit the blind shot. Because otherwise, it is a game over, right? 
Otherwise, it is a game over. Oy, 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 oy. Okay, all we need to do, we need to go for a blind shots over there. We do not have any other alternative options, and our Vaza went for a... Uh, our Vaza went for a base the capture. What a misread play. What a misread play. Oy, 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 oy. Well, that was sad, fellas. This is going to be a draw. And the main reason why is it going to be a draw? Because this guy decided to go for a base the capture instead of uh, capping the base. Um, there is... Usually, fellas, I am... I am feeling very, very fine when there is a situation, eh, uh, kill all, no cap, right? But in this particular situation, it was extremely, extremely bad choice just because two lights, we are near our base and there is no chance you can go through the all map um, just to slap them, right? That was sadness, but what can you do? It's okay. Anyways... 4.8 thousand damage, 300 assisting damage, we cannot complain about this by any shape or any form, and we have 22,000 profits. So, all in all, I think our session was quite weak today. Yeah, our session wasn't the finest, right? We have only 33% win ratio, we got 3.8 thousand damage, we got... Um, 400 uh, assisting damage, which is not the finest one, right? Um... But this is how World of Tanks is looking like, especially when the games are so blitz. Last game, I think we played very, very well. We did everything properly. Uh, the Mountain Pass, I do not really think that was a horrible play, although it was uh, also like 5 to 15 situation. And El Haluf, it was like one-sided gangbang. Um, I still feel the pain in my butt, if you know what I mean. But yeah, that's World of Tanks nowadays. Anyways, Panzer is not that bad, part 1. Uh, particular reason. There is a big spot in the frontal mantlet and if we're gaming would ever fix that, if we're gaming would make frontal mantlet very very hardly penetratable, I think this tank would see its, gl its glory days again, if I can say so, right? Because it is made out of weak spots. This tank has a weak shoulders. Obviously, if people are loading gold, they can penetrate you wherever they want to, as you could see um, in the last game against the Super Conquerors. Anyways, what this is what I have for you today, fellas. I enjoy my journey and i had a great time with this tank um but yeah anyways thank you very much for watching i hope you had a great time and i hope you enjoyed yourself and see you tomorrow peace